Hi guys, it's Zootopia. I just started the recording without my mic plugged in and I, I noticed I only managed to watch like approximately three seconds of the film, so don't worry, I haven't really seen anything. Anyway, as I was saying in the previous intro I recorded, I don't know much about Zootopia. There's animals, there's a fox, and there is a bunny, I think, and people think that the bunny is hot. I will give you my verdict, but regardless, man, let's... Let's just get right into it, man. Let's see, let's see what happens. Predators had an uncontrollable biological urge to mate and maul and. What kind of predators are you talking about? Damn. <laughs> nice. To be fair, that's a performance that goes kind of hard. A lonely hunter anymore. Today I can hunt for tax exemptions. Tax exemptions? But does that mean he wants to avoid tax? Yeah, just, by the way, just, 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 just to bring it up, I can't say the bunny is hot yet, because the bunny is clearly, like, six years old. Uh, I assume the bunny will be an adult at some point, so, that, because if everyone's saying the bunny's hot when it's a kid, that's, it's not a great look. We gave up on our dreams and we settled, right, Bon? Oh, huh? that's right, Stu, we settled hard. That's not how you be happy. Chat, you're chatting shit. That's the beauty of complacency, Jude. Uh, if you don't... The beauty of complacency? What the fuck? What a dickhead. I hate this guy. We're changing the world. Yeah. One carrot at a time. Amen to that. Are we going to get a little bit of an exploration this film on, like, how fucking, you know, like, your family and how you're brought up just sort of pushes you down a certain path in life and, you know, somewhat look down upon for trying to do stuff differently? And that killer instinct's still in our dinner. Uh, I'm pretty much sure it's pronounced... <laughs> Dunna. Damn. Oh. This guy is a dead trim. Oh, man. The next time you think you will ever be anything more than just a stupid carrot farming dumb bunny. I don't know when to quit. Yeah. So she just said Zootropolis, even though it's called Zootopia in America. So I'm wondering, do they like... Did they like redub everything and every all the text? As you can see, there, there's text that says Zootropolis and all of the lines where they say Zootopia in the American one. Did they redub it just for the UK version to say Zootropolis? If so, why? Why would you bother? Oh my, that what a rhino versus her in a boxing match. I don't think that's fair. I suppose if there's like tigers and shit and people that are that big, you probably I get why nobody believes in her to be a bunny cop. CPD's very first rabbit officer, Judy Hops. <laughs> Hops. What a what a creative surname. It's a real proud day for us little guys. Don't worry, make room, will you? Come on. Okay. Damn. Right. So we get we we're getting the sense that this guy doesn't really care about the inclusion. He's just doing it for like s social brownie points. Actually, your father does have a point there. <laughs> it's in their biology. Remember what happened with Gideon Gray when I was nine? That kind of racist, bro. I think I have heard a bit about this film. I think, yeah, I, th I think there's meant to be like racism kind of themes in this film. Oh, damn. That city looks like Asgard, bro. Look at it. Oh, hi. I'm Judy, your new neighbor. Yeah, well, we're loud. Don't expect us to apologize for it. Damn. 5.30? I'd be getting up at 5. She lacking, bruv. Officer Hops, you ready to make the world a better place? Yeah, nice fist bump. Our first bunny, Officer Hops. Yeah! Parking duty. Oh, damn. See, the thing is, like, I get why she's upset, but, like, realistically, like... She is a bunny. She should not be able to do the same kinds of things that all of these big cunts can do. So it does kind of make sense that she's not being given the big jobs, you know? You know, it's not like she just looks different. It's the fact that she is very much biologically different. This bitch getting angry that she's getting stereotyped, but she's just racially profiling this guy right now. He ain't done anything. Fifteen dollars. Thank you. Fifteen dollars. 
I guess they are quite big, aren't they? So you're gonna get the the thing for him? <clears throat> I can't thank you enough. So kind. That is a jumbo pop, bro. Look at that shit. You wanna be an elephant when you grow up? You be an elephant. Because this is your trauma. I don't think that's how that works. Yeah, bro, I, I was paying attention to her mouth movement there, and she said the animation of her mouth definitely was Zootopia, is what she said, not Zootropolis, and they've just fucking layered the, the re-recording over the top of it. The baby's driving! I, I, I was suspecting he probably is some kind of sussy criminal. But she did profile him regardless, I guess, but yeah, there you go. Oh, man! He's reselling them all. Lumber delivery. What's with the color? Oh man. Uh, that's redwood. And then, oh man, and he sells the sticks as fucking lumber. That's crazy. You kiss me tomorrow. Fight <laughs> off. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Tinned carrots in the microwave. Oh, what is that? No, this is just a temporary thing. Oh, it's the safest job on the force. Oh, she's not a real cop. Oh, Matt. Oh, damn. Oh, no. Fuck. My mommy said she wishes you were dead. <laughs> oh, dear. We got a 10-31. Okay, so don't turn around to cheer. That's not, that's not going to get you any points, bro. Oh man, they have like a mini city for the rodents. That's that's cool. This is sick. It's a little hamster city, bro. This goes hard. I like. I rate this. They got the tubes. Oh my god! Did you see those leopard print jeggings? No. <laughs> wait, is that Target? Is that actual? Is that an actual? Wait. Do they have Target bags? Is that like actual target promotion in, in a fucking Disney movie? What the fuck? You did stop a master criminal from stealing two dozen moldy onions. Mm, hate to moldy onions. There's gotta be somebody to find my Mrs. Otterton. I will find him. I will give you forty-eight hours. Yes. That's two days to find Emmett Otterton. Fine. Then we'll have to do this the hard way. Did you just boot my stroller? <laughs> oh, bruh. We are good at multiplying. Anyway, oh. Tax forms. You reported, let me see here, zero. Unf <laughs> <laughs> this is an L, bro. Bro, I, I rate him for... I rate him for the tax evasion, though. You, you gotta rate it. It's called a hustle, sweetheart. She hustled you. <laughs> <laughs> In Zootropolis, anyone can be anything. These guys. They be naked. <laughs> <coughs> These guys, they be naked. I mean, what's the problem? They don't have genitals anyway. Here we go. Mm. As you can see, man. There's no genitals. Like, it's just skin, bro. They probably don't even have buttholes either, bro. Bruh. <clears throat> this is like the only job sloths can do is stamp shit. Oh, bro, that was painful. You said this was going to be quick. Well, are you saying that because he's a sloth, he can't be fast? I thought in Zootropolis, anyone could be anything. He makes a fair point. He makes a fair point. I'm not going to lie. He's just dis dismantled the whole argument. Fine. As well as I can be. Hmm. What? Hang in there. Can I? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, bro. Uh. Two. Nine. T H D zero three. T. Jesus Christ! This is this is this is a good scene. I'll rate this scene. What do you call a three humped camel? I don't know. What do? <laughs> oh my God, man! Pregnant. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? Bruh. Fox boy really trying to waste their time. How the fuck is it even possible to pull it off that slowly? What the fuck? We gotta beat the rush hour in. It's night? 
<laughs> oh no. What is your problem? Does seeing me fail somehow make you feel better about your own sad, miserable life? It does, 100%. Yeah. My man. Oh, is that Mr. Big? Is that gonna... Stop talking, stop talking. Oh my god, that's not even Mr. Big. Okay, it is Mr. Big. Oh, that's Mr. Big. Okay, right, what the fuck? Mine cannot speak. You can't speak if you're mine. No, I am a cop. And I'm on the Emmett Island. You probably shouldn't say that. Imagine saying you're a cop at the fucking crime boss's location. Oh, true, okay. As if, she's the bitch with the target bag. Arthur, he went crazy. Ripped up the car. Scared my driver half to death. What the fuck's going on, then? He was a savage! Oh, shit. So what the fuck's going on? Are they, like, infecting these people with, like, rabies or something? Is that is that what it is? Buddy? Are you... okay? Okay, he's just like, he's just like the fucking thing now, so he's been infected with rabies, is that what it is? That's what I think it, that's what I think it is, I think it's like a rabies epidemic. Oh shit, cuffed him to the fucking pole. Why would he do, why would he do that? There was literally no need, they could have easily not fallen off there. If you thought we would ever trust a fox without a muzzle, you're even dumber than you look. Kind of sad, makes you understand why he wants to just fit in with this fucking stereotype of his animal. He reminds me of RJ from uh, Over the Hedge, this Nick guy. I was, uh, I was, I've been thinking that he was seems kind of familiar to me, but that, that's who he reminds me of. Smell weather! <laughs> Smell weather. Look at these dum dums. <gasps> so they've been. They, so there's people capturing the rabies animals, presumably. Why? Claw marks. Yeah, huge, huge claw marks. I mean, what kind of- <laughs> How did that actually jump scared me? I knew it was gonna happen as well, like, that was so obvious there was something behind there. I genuinely jumped. Oh, well, I, I'm, I'm a dumbass, bro. Enough! I don't want excuses, doctor- Oh, li- oh, true, Lionheart's here, what the fuck? The only animals going savage are predators. We cannot keep it a secret, we need to come forward. Mm. Right, so there's, so they're gonna assume that it's because they're predators, but it's actually gonna be because of rabies, I assume. We still don't know why this is happening. It could destroy Zootropolis. You have the right to remain silent. Uh, little prediction here. Do you think the sheep assistant has framed, has deliberately done this to try and frame him and get rid of Lionheart as the as the mayor because he's he's not he doesn't treat her well. That's my prediction. I think that might be what it is. So predators are the only ones going savage. That is accurate. Yes, that is accurate. Yes. Why? Why is this happening? We still don't. Oh no! Everyone gonna think it's racist. It's gonna be racist, bro. Oh, and damn. Logical component. You know, something in their DNA. Savage ways. She gonna make a fucking race war, bro. That's what she's gonna do. Was I okay? Oh, you did fine. <gasps> sheep, it's the sheep. It's the fucking sheep, I'm telling you. Nick, stop it. You're not like them. Oh, there's a them now. Uh, you know what I mean? You yeah, now Judy is the fucking racist one. Well, our city is 90% prey, Judy, and... Is she the new mayor? Bro, the evidence is building up. Thank you for the opportunity. Ain't no way she quitting, bro. Nah, bro. She ain't. She she'll be back. She'll be back before the end of the film. Oh, kids talking about those flowers, Judy. I use them to keep the bugs off the produce, but I don't like the little ones going near them on account of what happened to your uncle Terry. So it's these flowers that the the mayor is feeding to these fucking people somehow, and it's passing it on, and they're going rabies insane. Can't do it without you. I don't know, man. Realistically, I don't. I don't think. I think ignorance should be forgiven because, like, if you don't, if if you don't know something, like, how can you possibly do the right thing? You know what I mean? If you just don't know. Are you, are you just trying to steal the pen? Is that what this is? <laughs> <laughs> Bruh. All your favorite movies. Wrangled. Pig Hero Six. Wreck It Rhino. Oh my God! What the fuck? <laughs> we got a drop spot underground. Just watch it. 
Doug is the opposite of friendly. He's unfriendly. I was struggling for what the opposite of friendly was, and I'm glad you reminded me. Oh, so is he, they put in like the, the liquid inside little balls, which maybe could be disguised as food. Cheetah in Sahara Square. Got it. Oh, so he just fucking shoots him with it. Listen, I hit a tiny little otter through the open window of a moving car. There you go. Open up. We got your latte. All right, Walter and Jesse are back, so I'm leaving now. Out. That's a fucking Breaking Bad reference. I haven't watched Breaking Bad, but I I, I ain't gonna miss that, bro. <laughs> As if. How the fuck are they gonna fight these guys off? L. Oh shit. Judy. No. Oh dear. That was a good shot. Oh shit. Is he gonna blow up? If so, they ain't, there ain't gonna be no evidence. Oh shit. Maybe some of the evidence survived. Bruh, are you kidding, bro? All the evidence is gone. Oh, except for this. <laughs> I thought she punched him in the face. Judy! Judy! Mayor Bellwether! Yeah, she's with the fucking sheep, bro. It's gotta be her. How did you know where to find us? I'll go ahead and I'll take that case now. Run away, run now, run away. Oh shit. Run. Oh damn, for real. Hurry up! Oh. He is. Oh shit. Oh no. They're gonna have to find a cure for that, otherwise he's fucking fucked. Yeah, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, is he just pretending? I was considering that. Yeah, oh, are, are you looking for the serum? Well, it's right here. Well, you've gotten the weapon there? Those are blueberries. Blueberry. Oh, the blueberries. How did? Wait. How did? How was the? Oh, the gun. Okay, the gun was in the. Okay, right. Okay. I did notice that the little balls look like just like blueberries. I, I thought that might be relevant. In related news, doctors say the night howler antidote is proving effective in rehabilitating the afflicted predators. Yay! Rehabilitation. So no matter what type of animal you are, from the biggest elephant to our first fox. Yeah, let's go. Ops, wild. Parking duty. Dismissed. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, the just oh, that's that's pretty funny actually. That's that's like a meta just kidding from the script writer, bro. That's all that is. Oh shit, that was close. I hope you have a good explanation. Flash, what? Flash. Flash! Holy shit! Nick. <laughs> Man. Okay, yeah, that's the film. I didn't. I was kind of. Oh my fucking trackpad! Kill me, trackpad! If there is a post-credit scene, I ain't gonna know about it because my trackpad too shit for me to be able to even check. I'm telling you, bro. Yeah. So that that was that was zoo. That was Zootopia or Zootropolis or whatever, which is what it, I'm watching the UK version. Yeah, it, it was a bit weird seeing uh, the Zootopolis, Zootropolis just dubbed over where the animation, the animated characters were clearly saying Zootopia, like because it ends with a different letter, like Zootop, like do you know what I mean? Zootopia. You you end with your mouth open, Zootropolis. You got your yeah. They should have their mouth closed at the end of saying it, but it's open, so you know they're saying Zootopia. Yeah, I actually really enjoyed that. I think that's that's my favorite of the Disney animated films. I, I genuinely think that is. It's definitely I like I definitely like it more than than the princess ones I've watched. I mean, what else is there, man? Like Big Hero Six. I think I like I like this more than Big Hero Six. The only one that maybe I like more is Wreck It Ralph, but the first one, not the second one. 
but I'm not sure, man. This might, I might like this more than Wreck-It Ralph. I thought I thought this was really cool. Like when when I when, at the start, I was a bit sort of worried about like the 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 racism kind of themes that he was going for because I thought there was the odd line of that that was a bit like oh that's a bit mm. but I, I actually think it handled it handled it quite well it, it was quite nuanced I thought actually like it, it tackled a lot of the different relevant topics re related to like stereotyping people and stuff like that and yeah, I, I thought I thought overall it had some it had, it had good messages. Like it seemed like it had good intentions, and yeah, fair enough. Like because it's it's a difficult topic to tackle well. I think even if you are doing it through like a little little animal animated movie, but yeah, I think it, I think it was done pretty fucking well, bro. I, I I like I like Judy. I like I like Nick. They're both swag characters. I think Nick's really cool, bro. He really left an impression on me. Uh, as for it, is Judy hot? Like, I don't even think she's that hot, bro. Like, I, 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 I got, I, I got a soaker. I, I don't, I don't need nobody else. Uh, solid man. Yeah, I, I enjoyed this a lot. Uh, next week, I'm gonna be watching Moana. So, if you wanna, if you can't wait until next week. The full length and edited reactions to Moana will be up on Patreon right now. So you can find that in the link in the description. In, you can find that in the link in the description, the pinned comment. Or you can find it on this link up here. Uh, yeah, man. Solid. Go, go pledge to my Patreon because I, I want more money. Thanks for watching. See you later.